Hey, yeah. Uh, I got something to tell you. Uh, okay. So last night I'm sleep right. <laughs> I'm in a I'm in a good sleep right, and I hear this this whining, like a whine and a cry. It was like it was like yeah, like that, and it sounded like a baby, but at the same time it sounded like Chi Chi. I know my youngest daughter, and in my mind I'm thinking she done fell out the bed. You know what I'm saying? Because that's happened before to both of my kids. They fall out their bed, whatever. So I'm thinking, she done fell out the bed, and she's crying. But when, okay, let me tell y'all something, parents. When your kids, something happened to your kids, and they first cry, they start crying, don't move. Just be still, you know, because sometimes it fixes itself. You know, sometimes, like, whatever happened, they'll be like, okay, I'm good, and they'll just go back to doing whatever they were doing. So I'm thinking, Okay, she done fell out the bed. That's why she was crying, because she was shocked that she fell and hit the floor. I was like, but she's going to get up, and she's going to get back in the bed, and she's going to go to sleep. And that's what I was thinking. I was like, if I don't move, if I don't react, then she ain't going to hear me. She, you know what I'm saying? She, she going to keep, she going to stay in her room. She going to stay in her bed. That's what I was thinking, right? So I hear it again. And this time, I started hearing two of them. I'm like, OMG. I was like, somebody done left their baby on my balcony. Because that's, that's, that's where I started hearing it. Like, one, once, I, once I listened and focused, I was like, that's not coming from Chi-Chi's bed. That is coming from outside. I'm like... There's a baby on my balcony. So then, mind you, it's in the middle of the night. I'm like, should I call the police or should I go out there and grab the baby? And I was like, no. Nah, what if it's a setup? What if I go out there and somebody grab me? So I just, yeah, I was trying to process it and, and think. And I was like, what do I need to do? I was like, okay, what I'm going to do? I was like, I'm going to call the police. And then I'm going to peek out the window and make sure the baby is okay but i'm not gonna go out there or whatever until i'm on the phone with the police you know what i'm saying so that was the plan mind you it's in the middle of the night so i grab my phone and all of a sudden i hear somebody say mama and i was like okay that sounds familiar it didn't sound like my kids not the kids i have now it sounded like my child that I had. It sounded like my son. You know what I'm saying? And I I know the way my, my son, how he says mama. And that's exactly, wait a minute. Y'all don't know about my son. Okay. Before I had my girls, I had boys. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it sounded like. My son. So I'm like. Why is my son, why is he whining and crying? Why is he on my balcony? And I'm, I'm just laying here in the bed, y'all. I'm half asleep. I'm trying to make sense of it. I'm like, what, what is my son doing out there? What, what's wrong with him? And then I thought about it. Your son is not a baby anymore. He is grown, grown. So I'm like, nah, that ain't my son. That ain't my son. I like this. Why does it sound like him? I was like, man, I must be still asleep, man. I'm tripping. And all of a sudden, I hear another whining and crying. I'm like, and then both of them, they something, mama, mama, mama. I was like, man, I am tripping. Like, if, if it would have just been one child saying mama, it would have been understandable. But it was two of them. It was two of them. And they they, they was on my on, on my balcony. And you're, you're out there, mama. I'm like, I'm like, oh my goodness. I am tripping. I I know that's not my child. It sounds like him, but I know it's not him. Because he's grown now. You know what I'm saying? He's not a baby anymore. So he should not sound like that. His voice, you know, should have more bass in it. So I'm just laying there in the bed. I'm like, should I go out there? Should I call the police? 
Like I, I'm trying to figure out what I should do. And I was like, no, just stay asleep. You you tripping? You you don't hear nothing. But it got louder and louder, and it was it was it was two of them going back and forth like they like they trying to outdo each other. And I'm like, okay. I was like, I I gotta I gotta call the police. So I get the phone, and I'm about to call the police when something in me was like, you gotta have proof. Of what's going on because if if something was to happen to you you know what I'm saying why you on the phone with the police is up you need proof of what happened so I was like let me record this that way when I get on the phone with the police and everything and I go outside I'm gonna leave my phone in the house you know what I'm saying so if they did snatch me my phone will be here and the police can look on the phone and see what happened so that's what I did I started recording and yeah. Tell me why. Tell me why. I get up. I get up. And I hadn't called the police yet. I was like, I'm just going to peek out there and see how many babies is it out there. Because it sound, in the beginning, it sounded like it was one chat. But then it sounded like it was two children going back and forth to each other. And they sound like they was about, in the beginning, it sounded like a newborn baby. Like the, that scream, that, ah! <sighs> you know how newborn babies do it sounded like a newborn baby but then once you know they started talking and saying mama I was like okay well they gotta at least be like about 8 months you know what I'm saying so I'm like I don't it's a lot of stuff going on right now I was like I really don't want to bring them in my home but I don't want to leave them out there either so I was like let me let me, let me just get up Go look out the window and see if they are hurt. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm just trying to... Yeah, I couldn't process. I, I, I couldn't think straight. Tell me why. Tell me why. I was listening. And I was listening to the two of them. When they was mama. And they was, you know what I'm saying, going back and forth. And then I thought about it. You, you know my best friend. Y'all know my best friend, Jesus. He was like, girl... Do not get up out this bed. He said, because you is too comfortable and you were sleeping real good. I was like, I know, Jesus, I know. But I was like, I can't leave that baby out there. He was like, he was like, shh, just be quiet. He was like, don't make no sound. And he said, just listen. I said, I am listening, Jesus. I heard this baby whining and crying, looking for their mama. And I need to go out there and save this baby. And Jesus was like, shh, be quiet, just listen. So, I got quiet. I did what he said. You know, he's my best friend. He know right. I got quiet and I listened. Y'all. Yeah. I heard a meow. I was like, oh no. There's a cat trying to eat the baby. Because y'all remember when I had that cat, that uh, that cheetah looking cat. I don't know if it was a cat or a cheetah baby. Because it had, it had the cheetah print on it. But it was... You know, it it was a little smaller than a real cheetah, so I wasn't really sure if it was a a, a baby cat, a baby cheetah, a cub, or what, whatever it was. No, it was a full grown cat. Yeah, cause I I know the sound of a full grown cat. You know what I'm saying? Because like like I said, my son, he I've had him. Well, I had him since he was a baby, all the way to he was an adult. And in the beginning, you know, they sound like kittens in the beginning. But then when he got older, he was able to say words. Like, we're going to have to do a story time about my son, baby. Because when I tell you he could talk, that baby could talk. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm like, it's a cat. It's a cat. I said, it's a cat. It's some cats on my balcony. Why is it cats on my balcony? Because that cat who, you know, back when that kitty was on my balcony, I was like, he shouldn't be coming around anymore. I I did what I had to do to get rid of him. So I was like, I know that's not him because he's older. And the way that they are sounding, they got to be at least eight months, almost one. I was like, why are they on my balcony, man? Do I? I was like, I got to do what I got to do again to make sure that these animals, because we got a lot of animals over here. Everybody over here got a pet. Except for us. But it's a lot of people over here with pets or whatever. And sometimes they pets, they smell food. They want to come in here. So I was like, ain't no food cooking. 
Why is they on my balcony? You know what I'm saying? What, what, what is it? What do they want? And I just feel bad because they were looking for their mama because they was, Mama. Ah. I was like, oh, and it reminded me of my son, baby. Because my son, Taquan, we call him Ty for short. Y'all ain't never met him. I'm going to have to do a story time about him one day. You know what I'm saying? But, <laughs> y'all, it, he, it just, it reminded me of him. And I do miss him a little bit. But, like I said, he grown, so he don't need his mama anymore. So, he wouldn't be whining saying, mama. You know what I'm saying? So, whoever cats that was out there, because they wasn't kittens. They was adults or teens or whatever, they, um, yeah, they was able to say mama, and they can't say mama until they almost one years old. So, you know, I'm just, I just went ahead and closed my eyes and went back to sleep where I tried to, but that really messed me up, y'all, because I thought my child had fell out of the bed. I'm still up here laying in his bed thinking, like, don't move. She'll get up and she'll get back in the bed. She'll be all right. And everybody can stay asleep. But it wasn't even my child. Thank God it wasn't my child who fell out of the bed. Because, baby, that would have been a whole different story. <laughs> that would have been a whole different story. So, yeah, I just had to come and let y'all know about this um, whining and crying on my balcony. That almost gave me a heart attack. Yeah, I just had to let y'all know. Have y'all ever experienced that before? Yeah. It be that way sometimes. TTYL. Talk to you later.